Hello all, welcome back to our tutorials uh, on uh, high speed designs. So, in the previous videos, we have talked about uh, the series termination, the parallel termination, their advantages, disadvantages, and uh, where the series termination and parallel terminations are used, and how to select that particular resistor. In this video, we will talk about the Thevenin termination. So, if you see on the left, let us go to the next slide. So if you see this uh, uh, termination, this actually looks like a parallel termination, right? Yes, indeed. Uh, the Thevenin termination uh, can be said as an extension of uh, <coughs> parallel termination where two resistors are used. Uh, uh, one uh, looks like a pull-up resistor and other one is a pull-down. Actually, they are pull-up and pull-down which are used um, and uh, uh, they, they serve two purposes actually. One is uh, they act as terminators and also pull up and pull down. So, <coughs> let us talk in detail about uh, uh, the Thevenin termination. So, if you see here, the selection of pull up and pull down must be done such that uh, because these two are in parallel, right? So, the parallel combination of these two uh, must be equal to the characteristic impedance of the Suited uh, to this particular uh, um, LH2 divider. So um, that means uh, <coughs> Z is nothing but uh, the parallel combination of these two. So that's how you select a sister. Say. So there are cases where, depending on the logic levels, uh, you can select uh, uh, both the resistors uh, of equal values. They can be of different values. So it again all depends on what logic level uh, uh, you are using for your signals that are coming from the source. And then, uh, as we said, uh, apart from the termination, these are also acting as a pull up and pull down, right? So when um, while RP acts as uh, <coughs> the source of current, RPD helps to sink the current. So what advantage do we get? Basically, there could be some uh, logical levels, um, the drivers basically from the ICs where they might not be able to uh, source enough current at uh, high speeds so and also the load could be uh, a huge one such that there is a lot of burden on the driver so in such cases when you have a pull up uh, it reduces the burden on the driver and then uh, sources the required current so a, a, a very big advantage right uh, when we are driving these <coughs> loads uh, which consume current and then definitely sync option uh, we have seen uh, or and talked about uh, the parallel termination and we know clearly what uh, uh, the uh, the sync uh, resistor can do for us and then the voltage uh, which is dropped across these resistors uh, call, uh, is basically called a, a Thevenin voltage and let us talk uh, about uh, the uh, advantage and disadvantage. So, because we talked uh, um, about uh, how these resistors operate in parallel termination, so we aren't talking about much. Um, these, these resistors do perform the same operations. The first thing uh, where this Thevenin termination helps is uh, it eliminates uh, uh, the overshoot uh, uh, that might uh, occur on the trace because uh, right now we have a VCC which is uh, a fixed level uh, that means it is trace is pulled up to a certain level definitely um, there will not be an <coughs> overshoot that is seen and uh, uh, while that is an advantage definitely uh, having these resistors uh, um, a disadvantage because uh, uh, you have <coughs> dissipation across both of these resistors. Um, uh, let us uh, consider an, a scenario where the resource, the source, and the receiver are idle. Idle means uh, um, you, you are not driving any data over the PCB trace. In such a scenario, uh, what happens is uh, there is uh, definitely current that is flowing from uh, um, VCC. Uh, uh, through these resistors to ground that means there is a leakage that is associated uh, and definitely power dissipation so uh, which also meant uh, vcc is directly connected to the uh, ground so 
even when there is a, a voltage across this line, as we mentioned, even in the parallel termination, um, the PD is into picture and uh, there will be uh, some uh, leakage current through this uh, uh, pull down resistor. So, the, the, there is leakage, we have to live with it, but uh, uh, the kind of advantages that uh, these offer, <coughs> these resistors offer with respect to uh, the um, logic interfaces that we work uh, um, certainly overrides uh, the kind of uh, um, power dissipation. So, if you ask an engineer, uh, uh, would you be worried about uh, uh, a little of power dissipation that happens through resistors, or um, would you be more interested uh, in uh, killing your entire interface itself? Then definitely someone would vote for. Uh, um, yeah, their uh, interface to work properly, right? These small leakages can be, uh, may not be a challenge um, because uh, generally when we use these high-speed designs, uh, <clears throat> there'll be a huge circuit around and should be uh, power sources. Uh, may, may not be, most of them may not be a battery operated devices, definitely. Uh, so, uh, uh, power dissipation should not be a uh, major challenge, but certainly we can say there is a, a disadvantage in these uh, kind of interface and definitely um, these resistors uh, need to be uh, <coughs> placed and then uh, uh, a certain place should be added from the main place, which uh, is definitely a small stub. Uh, which adds onto the line. So that, that is another advantage, uh, disadvantage. So in parallel termination, there was only one stub that is in. Now we have a um, bigger stub actually here uh, from the traces. Um, and uh, uh, this uh, definitely uh, causes little uh, problem to the uh, signals. And then um, we meanwhile can <coughs> definitely use this uh, ter Thevenin termination across different uh, um, logic families. Now, uh, we initially mentioned, right, uh, one of the major uh, uh, advantage of this is uh, uh, even a, a driver which cannot uh, produce that much current to the load. In such cases, uh, the Thevenin termina termination is of uh, great help. Uh, so, um, one example uh, uh, is uh, uh, Peckle uh, logic levels, uh, which are commonly used. Uh, um, they, this is where uh, <coughs> the termination uh, is of uh, great help. Uh, certainly, uh, the TTL um, and the CMOS logic levels, uh, which are commonly used uh, um, between driver and receiver, this, this kind of uh, uh, termination is not uh, uh, so suitable we can use it but definitely not a preferable one um, for uh, those kind of uh, logic families so uh, that's where uh, uh, this comes so certainly the operation as we said is uh, very uh, close to the parallel termination but uh, uh, two resistors at a time uh, with certain advantages and uh, disadvantages uh, hope we gave a glimpse of this uh, uh, terminal termination uh, please post your comments please let us know if you know additional points about the if we make it more uh, interactive, uh, that helps uh, the viewers as well. Thanks for watching our video. Please like our video, subscribe to our channel. Thank you.